Hey guys, I wanted to show you a little bit of the behind the scenes of what I do as I record in my closet studio. So I have recently, in the last few months, I have invested a little bit of my own money to make a space so that I can record the podcast and be able to really focus and have space that is efficient so that I can record this podcast and get it all ready to go for you to listen to every single day. So here's a little bit of the behind the scenes to see what I do and what my setup is like. All right, so this is my desk. It's really small. You can see this is my closet. And yes, I have clothes here. The clothes are actually nice to have in here because they help to absorb any extra sound. And I have my hard drive that I use and I put all of my podcast stuff on this. But the thing is, is when it sits on my desk like this, it kind of buzzes and my microphone picks it up. So what I've been doing is I have my vest here and I just stick it in the pocket of my vest and you can see it's still plugged into my computer and that works perfectly. The mic does not pick up the sound of the buzzing. I have my headphones here that I put in. I have my mic and my computer and so I pull up my program and I start recording. So I set up my paper. These are my notes that I have and I get my computer all ready to go. Let's press record. Here we go. My mic is in a good position. Um, I don't want it too close. I don't want it too far. I have my headphones in so that I can hear and I also need to make sure that I press the mute button or unmute it so that it's actually picking up on the computer my voice and I make sure it's not too loud, not too soft, and then I get ready. So before I start, I always pray and usually I pray in my mind, in my head, and then once I'm ready, then I start recording. So it might go kind of something like this. It is another day and I am so excited because this week we are learning about God's 10 wonderful commandments. His happiness rules kind of reminds me of fences. Fences are in place to help keep things out or animals out and to keep other things safe. Think about the 10 commandments as being like a fence to keep your garden safe. Now I have a garden and in the summertime, the rabbits love my garden. And so you know what I have to do? I have to make sure that the fence is in good repair or those rabbits will get in and they will end up eating my vegetables. And in fact, I went through several weeks where I couldn't figure out what was eating it. And so we ended up setting up a camera in the garden so that I could see what was eating my plants. Is it bugs? Is it rabbits? It was rabbits. They were getting in and it was really annoying. And so I put that fence back up to protect my plants. God has given us his 10 commandments to protect us. Isn't that wonderful? So let's learn about those 10 commandments right now. Do you see how I end up recording and telling stories and putting it all together? It's a lot of fun. So once I have it recorded, then I save it and I upload it to our Google Drive so that my editors can be able to edit it and make it sound really good, take out all my mistakes because, oh, I make mistakes. And you can check out our bloopers sometime if you want. But we end up making it sound really good. And then once it's all done with that, then we upload it for you to enjoy. I'm so glad that you came and hung out with me today in my studio and kind of got a little behind the scenes of how we record and how it all is put together. And I hope to share more things about the recording process and what goes into creating and making this podcast for you to listen to. We're going to talk more about that in the future. But until next time, remember, we want you to start each and every day with Jesus. Jesus.